we would like to present you the new generation of walnut cracking machine which can also be used for cracking hazelnuts. Its special feature is that it is composed of the cracking unit and the separator which is mounted above the cracking unit. This is where the calibrating of the nuts takes place. Depending on the size and the hardness of the shell, the nut falls into an appropriate case. This way the pressure needed for cracking is adjusted accordingly. The cracked nuts are ejected here, at the bottom part of the machine, from where they are proceeded to the wind separating unit where the shells are separated from the kernels. By switching on the machine, the separator and the unit for sizing the nuts are automatically switched on too. With these buttons on the control panel, the speed of feeding the nuts can be regulated. It can be very small to very high. This way the capacity of the machine can be increased. In the event of any error, there is an emergency button which allows instant switching off. Since the capacity of the machine is very large, we have a constructed a conveyor belt. Its typical feature is that the container is without edges since walnuts tend to get blocked easily. At the bottom a vibration system is mounted which can be adjusted to a laser of greater power. Another special feature of this cracking machine is the conveyor belt which makes it possible that the nuts are fed into the machine one after another. This way there is no danger of overfilling. The conveyor belt has a special system which allows the regulation of the incline. It is fixed on wheels. Therefore, it can be easily moved and used elsewhere. The entire system is made of stainless steel. The air separation unit was already used in our previous machines. This is where the cracked nuts will drop. The cracked shells with kernels fall through this opening and here only the shells come out. This unit will also be integrated into the machine. The machine you can see here was assembled for the demonstration purposes. As you can see, you can purchase only what you need immediately and upgrade the system later. The sorting unit can be adjusted in such a way that a certain size of nuts remains uncracked. The result is as follows. Here and there a piece of kernel may remain among the shells.
This one, for example, it is very dry and light. This is how it looks. Oh, clumsy me, I spilled some. And here we have marked nuts in order to calibrate the machine.